Okay, guys, I just wanted to show you real, real quick what, we're stuck, what I was talking about before in my blog about the um, link local addresses. Um, because of the way it's defined in the RFC, uh, it says the RFC says that the first seven bits uh, are already set, uh, that uh, has a value of FE8. Uh, so, in fact, every address that you come across, link local address that you come across, it will be in fact, uh, will be in fact FE8. However, that is because 99% of the time um, the link local addresses are uh, set using the or configured set, uh, using the stateless address out of configuration. Uh, when that happens, uh, the uh, value for the link local address will always be FE8. However, uh, again, and because how is defined on the RFC, there are uh, other values that can be assigned to it. Uh, I'm going to try to do that now. I know that it's going to fail because Packet Tracer won't let me, but then I'm going to try to do it on my live router to show you that in fact you can. Um, because of the how the bits are organized or, or what the actually what the RFC states, uh, um, and this is all in, in the document itself that you were reading, uh, we can have a different values. The most common one will be FE8, but uh, because of the bets, uh, we can also have FE9, FEA, oops, A, and also FEB. And again, one more time, just because uh, uh, most of the time, 99% of the time, the addresses, link local addresses are assigned automatically, you will always see FE8. But now we're going to try to do it manually and try to assign one of these addresses. Let's go ahead and do that. T. Let's get into the under the interface. Zero. Show IPv6 interface brief. There are no IPv6 addresses configured at all. Now let's go ahead and do it manually. IPv6 address. Let's go with F E uh, A. Zero column column. Link local. When I hit enter, a real um, a live router will take it, will assign that IP address as a link or local address. IP, IP um, packet tracer will not, as you can say here, as you can see here, it says invalid link local address. I think that uh, because uh, packet tracer is uh, a tool for students, it's trying to reinforce the fact um, that this is, uh, or, or is trying to reinforce what the RFC says. However, if we move to a live router now, uh, live router now, uh, and I'm going to do that, pause in the video and get ready and then do it again, we're going to see that it does in fact work. One moment. Okay, I move into my uh, live router uh, because this is my live router and provide an internet to my house. I'm not going to uh, touch the interfaces. I'm just going to uh, create a loopback interface. Uh, one. Uh, I'm going to show you that there are no um, um, IPv6 addresses assigned anywhere, and then we're going to assign that we're going to do the same thing that we did before, that we did here. Wait a minute, that we did here. I don't know if you were able to see that, but uh, the same thing that we did in Pocket Tracer, we're going to do here. So let's say IPv6 address FE. A, I believe we use in packet tracer zero column column link local. Hit enter. No error messages. We're gonna do a do show IPv6 interface brief. And as you can see right here, the loopback one that we just created has the uh, link local address that we assigned to it, uh, FEA00, as you can see here. Okay, uh, I just moved back to the uh, packet tracer exercise. I'm going to show you now. First, I'm going to clear all the addresses, IPv6 addresses. Uh, to show IPv6 interface brief. There we go. No IPv6 addresses assigned. Um, at the beginning of the document, or at least the link local part of the document of the blog, it states that uh, a link local address can be assigned both uh, two ways. One is using the uh, stateless uh, address header configuration. I'm going to do that right now. 
what I get, what you can see here is that the f uh, interfaces do not have any IPv6 addresses assigned. Um, what I'm going to do is use a command uh, that you saw in the blog, uh, IPv6 enable. Just that command. Uh, is not, I'm not using an IPv6 address uh, command uh, to assign an address. I'm just going to enable the interface for IPv6. And you will see that automatically, 100% uh, automatically, uh, a link local address is assigned to that, IP, uh, to that interface, in this case, fast internet 0 slash 0. Enable. By hitting enter, we now see a do, we now do a do show IPv6 interface brief, and you saw that we see that in fact, an I in a link local address using uh, stateless address uh, auto configuration, which uses the EUI64 uh, format, uh, has been assigned to this address. Let me remove that. Uh, no IPv6 address. Do show. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, no IPv6 address. Why is it still there? Oh, wait a minute. See that? I'm not. I'm not uh, teaching what I preach. I used one command to uh, enable the uh, interface. Uh, I love these mistakes because this really uh, lets you learn. Uh, I enabled the interface. I did not assign an IP address, so there's no way I can use a no IP address command. I did not use an a IPv6 address such and such command, uh, so therefore I cannot negate that command. That's why it's not working. I have to say no IPv6 enabled. That's the command I used right here. Say. So when I negate that command, that address will be clear now. That um, IPv6 address will be clear. We just did it automatically. Now we're going to do it manually. Actually, we already did it when, did it when we talked about the um, uh, packet tracer not working. And it was working, in fact, in the live router. But we're going to do it again. To assign a link local address manually uh, to the interface, all you need to do is get into the uh, interface IPv6 address this time uh, and now is waiting for you to enter what address you want we're gonna say we're gonna keep the uh, default address and the only thing that we need to add right now to that is we need to say that this is a link local address let me see if I can do something here 2001 column column yeah no okay I thought that it was gonna, it's not going to show you the link local command because it wasn't a link local address that you wanted to uh, configure. But no, it, was, it didn't work like that. So, uh, all we need to say is that this address is, going to be a, uh, this address is going to be a link local address. By the way, this is a default, but if you want to uh, specify a specific uh, um, uh, value for the interface ID, uh, you can just say whatever you want here. Uh, number one, for example. No, not there. Wait a minute. Uh, here. And then when we're done, we hit enter. We do a show or do show IPv6 interface brief. And we see that the address that we just assigned manually is assigned to that address. OK, I hope this was understood. And again, if you have any questions, please ask. Thank you. Bye bye.